Well, good morning, beautiful, beautiful Libras. Welcome back, everybody. Happy Sunday. Libra, thank you so very much for supporting the channel by liking, commenting, and subscribing. It's truly appreciated. Let's find out this day for Libra. What messages the universe has for the beautiful Libra? What about Libra spirit? Messages, please, for the Libra community. What is it that you want Libra to, hmm, romantic love, Aphrodite love, something to do with uh, water or emotions. I see you focusing, focusing on the future. Hmm, the in-between. You're healing, so you're trying to focus on the future, but some of you are still at the in-between, wondering. You're still in your emotions. There is some romantic love here and compassion. Let's find out more. Kuan Yin is sending you compassion. There could be romantic love you're focusing in on. Maybe you haven't decided yet. Maybe some of you are still healing from a romantic love situation. What's going on here? It's time to play. Make time to dance and play. Imagination. Draw from the well of your own capabilities. Going within. Return to joy. We're here to experience joy. Listen to advice. Guidance is needed to cross this ocean of life. Willpower is here. Improve your willpower to reduce your stress level. So some of you are still trying to heal and you're trying to find your path. You are finding your way. Some of you are in between. Some of you have found your focus. Some of you are still finding that healing, trying to heal. What's going on for the beautiful Librans? It is time to return to joy and play. Increasing your willpower. So your light irritates their demons. That's what this is saying, because you are shining, your light actually is irritating their demons. And maybe they're acting uninterested, or you are uninterested in somebody. <clears throat> and maybe you are uh, focusing in on making it rain, you're, maybe you're focused in on your money and getting it. You may have had a lot of insomnia or paranoia or anxiety, unable to sleep, or maybe they are. Somebody is being haunted by memories, flashbacks, and trauma and the side effects of it. This person may have been always partying, like forcing their way upon you and it's like you're it is your light that disturbs these people whoever you're dealing with it's your light that disturbs their demons it's like they have to look inside themselves and it bothers them they force things on you you know they're forcing their way or use force to get what they want they're used to getting their own way Trying to get a closer look, nosy, all up in your business. They could be going through legal issues or, you know, dealing with courts or judges or immigration. And you're like, same shit, different day. You could be busy winning. You know what I mean? Or someone around you figured that they had hit the jackpot. You know what I mean? Maybe you're getting unexpected money. Maybe you're getting rich. Maybe you're getting inheritances. Hmm. And maybe they ghosted you. 
and maybe you ghosted them. But love is on the brain with Aphrodite love here. Someone's daydreaming. But something is, they're extra triggered at this time. Probably because, oh, may have started an argument. A girl fight, a physical fight. <laughs> this, if it's a third party situation, they're really triggered by you. But what's triggering them is your light. It really bothers their demons. Because somebody is really into you. They're into your vibes, your positivity. You're busy winning. You could be getting an inheritance or a windfall. Or they think that you do. And it's really pissing somebody off that you're winning. And they're trying to dodge a bullet using uh, haters. You know what I mean? To dodge a bullet. People who hate you or dislike you to get around their bullshit. You've got a hater. A happiness hater. Someone is jealous and envious. A hater. Because you're shining bright. Your light really is triggering them. Libra energy, what's going on? <laughs> yeah. Somebody, you may not be sleeping well, or is this person not sleeping well? They're really triggered by you. They are triggered by your light. You might have to get advice from someone. Hmm. So they're demons. See, your light bothers their demons. When you're around this person, it exposes their demons of who they really are. They're really triggered by you. You trigger this person. They might want to physically fight you. It is a girl fight we're talking about. It could be a guy fight as well. But I'm. that's their demon. They have demons. And when your light is around them, it exposes them. It really triggers them when you're nearby. Hmm. The key to wisdom. Because you're just being of service here. Your light bothers this person. Trust in alchemy. Hmm. Well, your light's bothering somebody. Because somebody is really into you. And it triggers... Whoever this person is, they hate it. They're always talking shit. You know what I mean? That's why they hurt you. There is an emperor here who might be dealing with um, a court system or some legalities of some type. Something to do with money or wealth. Hmm. Somebody is very aggressive. Hmm. We have an emperor and an empress here and we have a happiness hater. Somebody hates the fact that you're winning. You're busy winning, and someone hates the fact that you're winning. They hate it. Oh, that's a hoe, man. A queen of wands in reverse is someone who uses their sensuality or their sexuality to attract somebody. Yep, it is. Using sex to control someone. To make them, cause them to reject you. You're sitting over here getting good news. You know what I mean? Moving forward. You're focusing on... Mm, somebody is like 
there could have been a marriage here or a commitment and somebody I think somebody is inspired to come toward you somebody sees you as happiness and I don't think I think that this person was hustled for cash I do Juggled for money. Here is home, stability, wish fulfillment. Huh. Someone wants to work on something with you, wants to co-create with you. Maybe your focus is your business. Maybe you're focusing in on your career. Maybe you're just busy winning and your light irritates the shit out of somebody inheritance jackpot ten of pentacles they could be wrapped up in court with legal issues i don't know but i see you busy winning secret loves here Somebody is secretly in love with you. Hmm. Hmm. Well, they're heavily burdened financially and they see you as very, you're a light worker. I'm telling you right now, you could be an earth angel, but you're very balanced. Okay. And someone secretly is in love with you. And they're very heavily burdened at this time, financially. You're the magician. And they refuse to see that um, you're manifesting money, career, love, and your light is really, really irritating someone's demons. Because they're very, they're very greedy, whoever this person is. You trusted your intuition. You have the Ten of Cups, so maybe somebody is going to take leadership. Maybe you're in separation with somebody, and somebody is suffering from insomnia. Haunted by their past. Maybe you have trauma you're dealing with recovering from this trauma hmm. somebody was betrayed you spirit saying they ain't shit whoever this karmic is is not shit hmm. this person is secretly in love with you I don't know maybe they force things on you you know what I mean maybe they're aggressive maybe they force things on you why because your light irritates them it really bothers them maybe your strength bothers them and maybe they're going broke or worried about going broke they are looking you up. They're watching you. They're observing you. The karmic energy is seeing if this person is talking to you, messaging you. That's the truth. Hmm. Maybe they feel like they wasted their time, their money, their resources, and maybe they want a new beginning with you. Somebody was being a thief, either financially or energetically and somebody will walk away why do they want to return and why are they so damn aggressive they're aggressive they want to like force something on you and you're sitting here with the sword. Come on. I'll let you have it. 
I'll cut you out so fast you won't know what hit you. I don't care if I'm alone. You could be focusing in on your coin, your work, and getting blessed. This is fate. This is destiny. The wheel of fortune being in your favor. Justice is being served. Karmic justice is being served. And somebody don't like it. They're stuck. And you're succeeding. This is spiritual judgment. That they're facing. Spiritual karma. They're facing. Because of this love situation. Putting you in a competition. You know what I mean? Their own struggles. They struggle. They're struggling. They're going through a freaking tower. I think this person wants to reconcile with you. I think they want to come in slow and steady. Hmm. Somebody is got the higher ground here. Somebody figures they got the higher ground. You're spiritually protected and guided. You're successful. And it's irritating somebody. It's making somebody else sad. Hmm. They're feeling conflicted and defeated. Hurt wounded that you're succeeding your light is really irritating their demons they are extremely triggered every time they hear about you every time they see you they're triggered it sets off triggers for this person it's your light it's why you're attracting haters that's why you're attracting people who are jealous of you, because it's your light they detest. Take care, Libra. Good luck.